r slash isridin people who have an odd job what is your job very cool i work for the president of a company he can't read or write i do these things for him that'd be fucking awesome a translator for the one only language i know i used to manage anonymous whistleblower hotlines I'd gather all the reports every morning and make sure they were anonymous, remove pronouns etc, and route them to the right person. The drama I got to see every day was amazing. Do tell. I was briefly the graphic designer for a big, local, mobster while also the graphic designer for a lot of drug dealers with shady businesses. It was all cash, and I was good. Really good, at graphics in the mid 90s. Good times. I need to know what they needed graphics for. Back when Miss Payne's skills paid. I train lab techs for my company. This job is literally impossible to do correctly. If I do it badly, we wind up with techs who make dangerous and costly mistakes. If I do it well, they invariably leave for better jobs at other companies, because why wouldn't they, and my directors yell at me about turnover. Oh. It sounds like your company is too short-sighted to realize they're training their competitors. Business will try everything before they pay their employees more. An odd job I used to have was working on a program to help control a certain type of fly that damages apples. Basically I'd spend a lot of my work hours scraping dead bugs off of glue traps and counting the different species. That sounds very much like my job. I own a company that erases hard drives. Did you get wiped out in the hard drive crash of 21? I'm a swing bridge operator. Is that the type of swing bridge that spins out of the way for boats? Didn't even know they existed. Here in NC a swing bridge is a flimsy wire suspension bridge, for pedestrians mostly, that, well can swing around a bit. I perform music for elder care facilities. Yes, I love it, which is the only reason why I do it. This is the kind of living where if you don't love it, you will hate it. This will be a funny job for the new generations, if nursing homes are around, imagine the musicians plays the newer popular tunes. Frontier Paramedic. Odd AF. Never thought I'd be dodging horse-drawn buggies and herds of deer on the way to a domestic assault, but here I am. LOL. Frontier Psychiatrist? That's cool I never heard of that before. Q Weird Al. Where do you do this? I left it recently, but my last job was to figure out where stray animals came from, get in contact with their owners, convince them to come ID their animals, and then charge them hundreds of dollars to get their animal back. I used to be an aquarium service technician. I would go around to people's houses and clean their fish tanks. It's one of those jobs most people don't even know exists. I know of companies that design aquariums for people and companies, and then they lease or buy them, as well as buy the cleaning service from them. Odds maker. What are the chances one of you would comment here? What do you do the odds for? And what kind of establishment, brick and amp, mortar casino, online site, etc. I used to have kind of an odd job, but a fun one. I performed failure analysis on microprocessors. When we had a failure in the field or during reliability testing, we'd try to figure out why so that we could improve things. It was like doing autopsies, but on integrated circuits instead of people. I remember knowing a guy who did the job similar to that. I'm a pinball technician, I fix pinball machines, and basically get paid to play pinball for hours a week. I am the go-to guy for a terrorist obsessed with gold. I throw my hat at people he doesn't like. A very odd job indeed. That's kind of a random task. All I know is I'm not throwing bars of gold at you. That'd probably just make you angry. Was waiting for that. Mopman at the peep show. I sell marijuana legally. I don't know it's odd that I'm technically a drug dealer but considered a butt tender. Calgit has dank if you have coin. I count every other duck. I draw. And somehow some people pay me actual money to do it. I'm not an envious person. But you, I am deeply envious of your occupation. I'm a high dollar escort that works mostly in the UAE. What would shock us the most, from what you have seen? Is it all Epstein Island out there in highbrow land? I've seen a lot of weird jobs in response to this question, but this I'm putting in a completely different category of weird. I hope you like your job. Are those real? Holy shit. I am tempted to see if they will pop. Do you feel safe doing that? Have heard there's pretty big risks about to do that in a country like that. Crime scene investigator. Enhance. 
Very cool. That's nice, what is the most common crime for you to work on? Is it really a valid play style to shake the machine? Is it because of those people that there are a never ending stream of broken pinball machines? I work in a mortuary. Dead end job. Not anymore, but I used to watch a human heartbeat for 9 hours a day. It wasn't inside of a body either. Zamboni driver. Tables. Tables. What does that mean? No questions about the tables, please. What the hell did Eddie Munster do to your tables? I work with dogs. Roughly about 18 dogs a day. I calm them down, give them food and water, if they need it, pick up any waste, then move on to the next house. I usually do 10 to 12 houses a day. Digging in the ground to stop fire from burning more of the forest. I'm a team lead slash supervisor of a research and development lab that's working on mechanical body parts. Currently trying to figure out how to connect a prosthetic to central nervous system and brain to give the patient full control of it. I'm a scientist and I work from home used to do in lab work but now I do data review, QC, training etc because our experiments are tracked in online software. It's for pharmaceutical development so it ranges from in development products all the way to commercial products. Testing everything from color to clarity to ELISA to SDS page to HPLC to impurities to dissolution to GC and more. ETA, I also used to work for the USDA in potato research. No joke. Not present but I used to do living history field trips and pirate birthday parties at a ship museum. I have friends that still do. I had a part time side hustle in Hawaii where I would jump in the water at night and connect a line of barrier boys around oil ships that were docking overnight as a preventative measure to guard against any oil spills. Freaky swimming in pitch black, kinda stinky harbor water late at night, thinking about what might be lurking just below. I was a dirt inspector for a while. I would literally sit there and watch guys dig a hole then fill it up with gravel. When they were done I would go poke the dirt with a fancy stick and write down that they dug the hole. The job is being a gold magnate and hot job is the Korean manservant. I'm in aviation. I get to work as much or less as I want, the days I want, the starting time I want, and where I want. I also get free first class airplane tickets all over the world. This year, I've been to Tahiti, Amoria, Hawaii, California, the Houston Rodeo in Texas, New York, Lisboa, and Porto in Portugal, Paris, and Frankfurt and Munich in Germany. And GT, I'm in aviation. That's not a job. My job is to hold police and government workers accountable by recording their wrongdoings and violation of basic human rights. Ignorant people berate me sometimes for exercising a right, they are too stupid to realize we have or either do know and don't acknowledge I'm putting that right to good use. You should do AR slash IAMA. I bet it would be fascinating. I throw hats at people. So you're a ripper dog. Gotcha. Oh my god, literally the reason I want to study mechanical engineering slash robotics. I want to do this. How do I do this?